I'm going to go inside now. Then I'm going to call my brother. Uh -huh. He's a cop. Mm. It's scary. Scott is just such a unique voice. His writing is just so different to anyone else. Plenty of history's great misogynists have had daughters and girlfriends, right? Like who? He's read a lot about this world. He hasn't killed many people himself, but it's very authentic writing. I love that he embraces the ums and the awkwardness. No one. I think we should um, move on. That it actually gives a greater sense of, of the truth of what someone's trying to say rather than it being perfectly succinct because we just, we don't talk like that. I think it lends itself towards very underplayed, heartfelt, truthful performances, you know? I think about it. Okay, that's good, that's good enough. Mm -hmm. You want a cuppa? Yeah. Often with second seasons, it's just more fun for everybody because the writer is, is now writing for a character that they've seen and you're not second guessing what you think the writer wants. The process for writing season two, researching, reading books, stealing from other people's lives, people that I know, personal experience, whatever I'm living, that's what I'm writing. I'm oh, sorry. Yeah. I kind of figured, well, if I'm having a bad year, then Ray should too, you know, why should he miss out? So, you know, he cops it. But misery loves company, you know, so, you know. Having him on set is just a bonus, particularly for me because most of Freddie's scenes are with Ray. So at any time I can just say to the writer, hey, uh, Scott, what did you mean by this? So what's with the no socks? It's called fashion, mate. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, it's not something you'd know too much about. Logistically, if things aren't working, it's very easy just to talk to him about, you know, what would Ray do in this situation? Because he knows the character better than anyone, seeing he created it and he's playing it. It's very collaborative. We'll go through the script and at the end of the day, if there's lines that we're not happy with, there's things we think we don't need, we'll take them out. There's room for improvisation. And some of my favourite lines are by actors improvising, not stuff that I've written myself. Why don't you come down here and you can dig it? I'm not going to... Why would I...? Which makes me look good as a writer because the audience doesn't know that I didn't write them, so... Mate, you know. well, what happened? I just thought I'd have a lie down. The tone of Mr Inbetween is... I mean, I think I've been asked that before and I think I said a black comedy, but I don't know if that's really right. I mean, it's, you know, people say dramedy. Maybe it's a black dramedy. Look, I don't want any trouble, OK? Well, I don't want any trouble, mate. It's really grounded in reality and the dramatic tension is broken beautifully with some really grounded in reality humour. It's pretty good, mate. What's the herb you got in there? Basil. I think what makes the comedy work in this show is the drama. The drama makes the comedy funnier than it would be if it was just a straight comedy. I just kill it, will ya? I don't kill bugs, mate. Well, you don't kill bugs, you just kill people. I don't make any sort of conscious decisions about tone. I don't say to myself, well, this year it's going to be more of a comedy or this season it's going to be more of a drama. It's just what comes and what are the best <laughs> ideas. Mongrel bastard! To capture the tone of the show from the actor's perspective is getting all the comedy out there without actually playing any of the comedy for laughs but be aware where the laughs are. They've got him in the boot of their car because they didn't feel like getting rid of the body just yet. Yeah, all right, settle, settle down, will you, mate? Don't tell me to settle down. No, not for me. Tonally, the show is really like nothing else. You know, it's a drama. It's incredibly dark at times. It can be very violent, but not an episode that goes by that's not also hilarious. Nice eye. Nice face.